All right, now, this is where things start to get kind of complicated. Welcome back to the Let's Play, guys. We are still in the survival area part of the... I think it's just called the fight area this whole island is, or something along those lines. And, um... Probably gonna get a little mixed up here, because it's, it's a lot of rock climbing around various locations. And it's not exactly straightforward, but we do need to continue east, because I do want to traverse the entirety of this island, and also, there is stuff to do over that direction. So, let's head up here. I skipped a trainer. I don't want to do that, so let's go back and battle this trainer real quick. My goal today is to try to get to, um, what's it called? Stark Mountain? Is that what it's called? Or something like that? Because, um, this is the last episode in this particular three-episode recording session. So if I can get there, depending on the way things schedule out, um, I may be able to take some time in between episodes to work with that guy Buck, I think was his name, who we met over by the entrance to the Battle Frontier a couple episodes ago, and effectively do infinite training with him and get my guys up several levels. Uh, which, I mean, they're, they're not... They're not, like, under-leveled or anything, but I'd like them to be a little over-leveled. I feel more comfortable in the post-game if my guys are able to just just automatically beat down anybody they come across, right? And right now, that is not a thing that they can do. In fact, this Hitmonchan actually making me kind of nervous. Hitmonchan can be pretty dangerous, even to flying-type Pokemon, and it is a higher level than me, and I do not like that. Because I'm I'm the champion right now. I should be the strongest guy around. Alright. But yeah, I'd like to at least get to the mountain today and start. So that is our goal. Is that I I mentioned uh, episode before last, I think. That there is more story stuff. Let's head up here. Um, in in this post game area. And that does take place at the mountain. Okay. Don't need to do that. I'll I know you guys have said before that you actually like seeing me tend the berries. You will see a little bit of me tending berries soon, I promise. But it's not necessary to do it there. Uh, there, rather. Still got a frog in my throat. It's very weird. Get up there. Item. Lagging tail. Literally could not care less. God dang it. I wanted it to be a double battle. <sighs> Stanley the Dragon Tamer. Somehow your friend didn't hear us talking and also turned to battle, but whatever. It's dumb. Dratini. Okay. Not really much of a threat. Hit it with a discharge, please. Mischief's about to level up, but Mischief is a lower level than the rest of my guys. And also has less HP than all of my guys. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> that time I choked on my water. <laughs> that was entirely my fault. Um, so, um, even after Mischief levels up, due to my training system, Mischief will still be the Pokemon that, um, I'm, I'm training for at least one more level. Might need to rethink the system, come up with something that offers a little more variety. I'm still faster. This thing is Dragon Dance twice, it's effectively doubled its speed, and my, my, uh, Rotom is still faster. That's kind of sad. And that won't even level me. That that gave me so little progression. Wow. Tratini's really weak, man. Like, it's this uber-rare Pokemon, at least, you know, in, in Gen 1 it was, that evolved into this thing that was basically another legendary. But it itself is just not good. It's not a good Pokemon. Hmm. I, I, I kind of forget that sometimes. Dragonair is a little better. But Dragonair is not great either. Like, Dratini and Dragonair are literally just there to be annoying as you level them up to become Dragonite, because they take so stinking long to level up and also just aren't great on their own. Though I do really like Dragonair's design, right? Okay. That hurt. Fantastic. Another hit will probably knock me out. Uh, we 
which is a bad thing because I'm going to get hit again. Maybe my special defense boost there will, will save me. I hope it does. Yep. Just barely, though. Like, straight up, if not for that special defense uh, buff, I think it would have done just enough damage to knock me out. That levels me, though, which is good. Now, can I get out of this battle so that beeping will stop? Thank you. Victory, that is. Victory for you. Yeah. I, I noticed. I was there. And... Ah, god damn it. I was going to say, real quick, before she sees me, I'll um, heal up. But that didn't work out at all. God damn it. And they're they're birds, so theoretically I could just I could just mow through them. But I don't want to risk that, so I'm going to come in here. I'm going to hyper potion mischief and probably get knocked out somehow with one hit. Because mischief is is fast and pretty pretty powerful, but also kind of frail. Mm, at least I resist that, right? Right? Yep. Okay, that didn't do as much. That wrong button. Didn't do as much as I expected either. So, just discharge. See how much a discharge, like an uncharged discharge, does. And uh, very nice. Looks like maybe I could have just swept through a team without healing. Also, still, I'm also still training Bidoofus in case you guys hadn't noticed. All right, so this thing is weak to both of my types. That's good. Um, let's try for a Shadow Ball just to mix stuff up, right? Uh, smack. Let's do it. Yep. I always liked Zadu. I don't know if I've said this before, but if I if I had encountered Zatu earlier on in my first... How could I be tougher than Mother Nature? Have you ever met Mother Nature? I own... I've, I've, I've captured most of Mother Nature in Pokeballs. Um, if I had if I had encountered Natu early on earlier on in my playthrough of Gold Version back when I first played Gold Version, that's not bad. Um, I probably uh, would have used Natu instead of Pidgey. But I'm not even a hundred percent sure how early on you can encounter Natu. You might have to be able to get a little deeper into the Ruins of Alf first. I feel like I should know this now. I'm gonna now. I've, now, now I'm gonna have to go, go look it up because I'm gonna feel dumb until I know. Because I've played that game so much, right? Um, is there something up here? Yeah, my dousing machine app on my um, Apple smartwatch. Oh, there it was. Oh yeah, there's like three things here, which means they're probably just stinking mushrooms, right? Yeah, just like straight over here, big mushroom. All right. Right, I'm a little confused. Where's it at? There it is. PP Max. Okay. Okay, that's that's definitely worth getting. Now there's some water, which um, since I am still training mischief, that's good because we'll be dealing with like swimmers again and stuff. But first, I'm gonna head around south to that little bank um, right around here because um, there's got to be something here too, right? Yeah. A heart scale. That's pretty good. Very nice. This, this is a cool area. Like, this, this whole island's cool. Because, um, it, it, it really, it really goes nuts with the whole, like, style of world construction that's present in Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum. Where there's just, there's just areas that they're out of the way, but, like, finding them is intuitive. It's just, it's just, it's very neat. Swimmer Lydia with three Pokemon, a Meryl to start. This is before Meryl got its cool second typing, which wouldn't help it here, but, you know, it's worth noting. Discharge. Zappy Zap. This will probably knock it out, right? It's just a Meryl, yeah. Beautiful. Didn't give me much experience, though. Hey, Bidoof is leveled again. Wants to learn Super Fang. Um, usually I'd give it Super Fang, but I've still got these HM moves on it. I'm not going to get rid of Hyper Fang or Roll Out, so, no. Yeah, I give up on it. If I ever do 
Ooh, that's that's a big big one. Um, if I ever do decide to, for whatever reason, go and try to optimize Bidoofus's move set in um, in in this playthrough, I will probably maybe maybe I will give it Super Fang. I'm not sure. Okay, thing has a lot of HP. I wasn't 100 percent sure I'd one hit KO it, but you know I did. That's really what matters. Um, yeah. All of her Pokemon are round. All of her Pokemon are just round boys. Or girls, I don't know. That's that's adorable. She's they're they're all they're all squishy little blue balls. That's cute. That that's that's a cute theme for a team. Not an effective theme for a team, but a cute one, right? I like that. Gives gives that, that random character a lot of personality. Hey, what's up here? Something, I would imagine. No, just just a patch of grass that I don't care about at all. Sure. Why is that there? Who knows? I mean, it's kind of cool that it is, I guess. But why is it there? I mean, what is this house? I don't even remember. Are you another one of the tutors? Konnichiwa, Guten Tag, the Meister. Okay. Something. Yeah, I like Pokemon. Wunderbar. Yep. Power up the Pokedex so I can see descriptions in other languages. Okay. Yeah. Sure, here you go. Nice. Um, don't care. <laughs> I mean, that's neat, I guess. But, like, just not something that matters to me. What's up this way? Let's go, Sluggo. Oh, screw that. What is here? Rare candy. Alright, cool. Um, you know what? You know what? Would that would that be over here? Maybe. Yeah. Give it to Bidoofus. Cause why the heck not, right? Um, and then go back up to the Stinger Repels. Eh. All right, let's keep going. Surf, surf again, Sluggo. And um. It's down there. Anything? Nah, it's just... Now maybe there's something off to the right there. I don't know. Let's let's go find out. See, look at this. Look how complex this is. It's very cool. Yeah, there's a person who's just chilling out here. What do you have to say, and or what Pokemon do you have? <laughs> Pokemon are all pumped up and ready to go. Okay. Sure. Three of them. Are they just Magikarps or something? No, Carvana. Interesting. I like Carvana. It's, a, it's actually a pretty dangerous Pokemon for mischief. Should probably get rid of that thing real fast. I'm running low on discharges, which sucks a little bit. I'm doing all right, though, I think. Because, um, like, my, I'm leveling pretty slowly because of the experience share. I sh still shouldn't... Eat, got, it looks like they're all Carvanas. That's kind of annoying. Um, so I can't even use Shadow Ball as like a secondary way of knocking these guys out because because they resist ghost moves being dark types um i shouldn't be training mischief that terribly much longer right and i do have some pp restoring stuff too it's not it's not like the end of the world certainly not the end of the world as we know it though i do feel fun all right i actually need to step away for just a second i apologize all right sorry about that i'm back no idea what that was. My whole computer just glitched for a second. Though it seems like the game kept going. I was going to say, let's see if we can get a, get a one-hit KO on the Sharpedo, too. We did. That's all that really matters. Uh, even if I have to cut a little bit there, it's fine. <laughs> That's very weird. Uh, I'm a little worried now my computer is dying. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> uh. Um, so I can go this way, too. Which I'm actually gonna go this way first. Through this little gatehouse. Okay. I forgot about this part of the route. Nope, I'm, I'm just gonna go to the stinking volcano. Uh, I thought we were almost at the resort area, but we're not. It's just... yeah. Okay, so this leads up towards the volcano. Can I, can I like, get over here? Yeah, I can. Is there, like... A thing here or something? No? Alright. Um, 
Oh, there's freaking freaking bike things. God damn. I hate the bike. Man, don't really. It's fine. Just walk my bike over here. God dang it. Totally screwed up my momentum. I want to fight this guy anyway. And I've got the urge to battle with you. Hope you're willing to oblige. I mean, sure. Why not? Trying to level up my weird electric ghost guy. Saul. Taros. That's cool. Oh, and that is a very cool... That is a very cool seal for Taros, too. Very nice. And intimidate means literally nothing to me. Confuse Ray. Looks like we had similar ideas there. Um, that's not great, though, because I've got pretty flimsy defense. Come on, hit it with Confuse Ray, please. Thank you. Good. Fantastic. Uh, I can't use Shadow Ball on it, which sucks because it's normal type. I can switch, though. I'm not gonna, but I, I, I mean, I could. <laughs> Freaking hurt itself. I mean, it's a Taurus. They go pretty buck wild anyway. So, um. Oh, come on. So there's a fairly decent chance it would just run into something and hurt itself anyway, right? I mean, not really in the mechanics of the game, but like. I, I almost said IRL, but like, you, you get what I mean. In like a realistic Pokemon battling scenario, right? Don't hit yourself again. All right, that doesn't really matter, unfortunately, because um, it's going to knock me out. Um, so I'm just going to go heal, because I still need to level Mischief. Um, yeah, this sucks. This Taros, man, quite, a, quite problematic. Okay, hit yourself again, come on. Yep, good, good. Alright, I am gonna... freaking god. I'm gonna charge again, because I... Oh, shoot. That might take me down below half, and it won't even matter. Oh, no, it didn't quite. Okay. Snap out of confusion. Because that way I'll... I'm... I'll, I need to... I need to conserve uses of discharge, so I might as well ensure that I can do as much damage with discharge at one time as possible, right? Doesn't payback do extra if I've already hit him this turn? It's kind of like, like Avalanche or something? Or am I mistaking it for Avalanche? I'm just wondering because the, if, if I'm right, then the fact that he's faster than me is actually really hurting him here. And not bad. Not bad. Okay. No, you're fine. I mean, you only had one Pokemon. You weren't going to beat anybody out here anyway. Jeez. Don't want to start another fight yet. Holy crap. Um, grab another one of these. And then go see if I have an ether or something. Nope. Alright, sure. Whatevs. I'm gonna save, too. It's always good to save right after you use a really rare item when you don't actually technically need to. Ugh. Yeah. Alright. Hey. Fight me. Now oh, that's annoying. Because um, my ability gives me one of my immunities. <laughs> okay, that sucked. And I really thought it was going to go down with that hit, unfortunately. Hmm. <laughs> Let's hope that the next Pokemon isn't a ground type, because if it is, its ground moves can actually hit me right now, and that would be bad. And this should do it. Um, it's like I need to uh, drop down here. Eh. Careful, careful. Why am I still on the stinking bike? Is that? Hey! Hey, it's, it's Barry and Crash Awake, so I, I should just head back. No, I'm kidding. Hey, guys, how's it going? I don't remember what voice I gave Wake. No, if it isn't Hero, it's been a while. You've grown so tough that you're training out here now. Everyone keeps getting tougher and tougher. And in doing that, they've developed closer bonds with their Pokemon. Hulk Hogan. Doing the Ultimate Warrior, in case you couldn't tell. I'm trying to, I'm bad at it. That's my master! Those are words of wisdom! What? Are you still having trouble understanding, Hulk Hogan? I don't... At first, or I don't for a second ever recall accepting you as my apprentice. I mean, if it's wrestling moves, I can... Show you all you like, but... Ah, Master, don't be that way! 
Uh, you've got to get me into that club in the survival area. How did I get involved in this? He look, he turns to me. He's like, how did I get involved in this? Ah, uh, nobody likes Barry. It's so good. It's so funny. So anyway, Hero, you're going to Stark Mountain. Even the wild Pokemon there are very, very tough. If your Pokemon aren't well trained, they'll have a miserable time. And again, that kind of challenge is an exciting prospect. No matter what, you'd better be fully prepared. I've got to get ready for another tournament. Farewell. See ya. Are you going to say something to me now? You know, I think I got a little tougher again. That's why I'm off to the battle frontier, so I can make some challenges. Master, wait for me! Leave him alone, Barry. He's going to suplex you eventually. Is this a rest house now? Looks like it. Rest me, old lady. Came out weird, but sure, I'm gonna I'm gonna roll with it. Um, I'm gonna leave now. Stop trying to make me sleep more. And um, I guess we're technically at the mountain. I wanted to be further up than this though, so I'm just gonna keep going. There's an item down there that I don't care about. Hey, it's this guy. Uh, yo, if it isn't a hero. Now training uh, uh, right away, are ya? Uh, so, uh, s uh, since you're training anyway, can you do me a favor? I'd like you to patrol Stark Mountain for me. Yeah, sure. Up past here, uh, there's this uh, volcano. It's Stark Mountain. I know, I, I'm, I can see it from where I'm standing. Deep inside it is this special rock called the Magma Stone. I can't explain it well, uh, but it's really important. It, it keeps a Pokemon asleep. But lately, I've been hearing rumors about Vandals in Stark Mountain. They say goons in space suits are causing trouble there. Ah, oh, God. Huh? What? Me? I was on my way to the Pokemon Center because my Pokemon's low on HP. There's a house. Like, right over there. There's this old lady. She's a little creepy. But she'll heal your Pokemon for you. So if you could get up to Stark Mountain now, that'd be great. Thanks. Sure, buddy. Um, Is my repel active? I don't know. I want this item, though. Okay, that's good. Check down here real quick, because I can, assuming I can line up with it. How am I still on the bike after that? Charcoal, okay. Makes sense out here, but I don't need it. Head back up. Climb, please. And now I have to go back around. God dang it. Uh, there's a freaking person. I have to battle the person for freaking charcoal. Wasn't worth it. Get through this quick. Three Pokemon. Are you kidding me? Ow. Screw you. Get bent. Boom. Punchy, punchy attack. Kaboom. Screw you. Double screw you. Alright, punchy punchy attack the second. What an annoying trainer. Yeah. Thanks. I, I still don't like you. Okay, there's that guy again. I could go heal at the place with the thing, but I'm not going to do that. Instead, I'm going to reorganize my guys because I can. I actually just now realized that Fire Main should be next, based on my usual way of doing things. But I um, completely misread how much HP it has, so there we go. And there we go. Right, let's, um... So I forgot to put another Repel on. There we go. Cool. Head up this way. Um, it's like I have to come down here. Ah, God, another battle. Looks like he's a fighting type trainer, so this shouldn't take too terribly long. And look at that. I was right. Alright, we shouldn't be that far now. Yeah, here's the mountain proper. Um, get off the stinking bike. Should probably check over here first, right? Another person. Do I care about this person? I don't think I do. I'm I am standing literally over a volcano. Okay. 
That's super dangerous. What's over here? Uh, way down, I don't care about. There's an item up here, though, right? Let's grab that. Life orb, okay. That's, um... That's just pretty generally useful. I might actually give that to somebody. Get on down. Um, ideally I'd give it to somebody who can heal, right? But... Maybe Greyfeather? Maybe Greyfeather can make use of it? Are you a trainer? You are. God dang it. Oh, and he's actually got a good Pokemon, too. Well, crap. Switch to somebody who actually has a chance of beating it quickly. And Dragon Rush missed. Okay. And it just wastes his turn with safeguards. So I have two chances to hit with Blizzard, which is, you know, good. Ugh. This probably won't even do it, will it? Come on. Okay, it did. But I get the feeling that that was, like, barely. Yikes. Firemane still leveled from that, too. Very nice. Yeah. Yeah, I don't care, man. Okay. Now let's um, keep going. Let the let the episode run a little long, I guess. Okay. I'm, I'm literally right by the stinking volcano. This should be just straight up killing me. And there's freaking... God damn it. Freaking Team Galactic. I hate these guys. Ugh. Not even paying attention to what they're saying. You guys can read it. Talking about Karen... Replacing Cyrus and how they don't think he can do it. I don't even care. I'm just going to go curb stomp him. Into the stinking cave before I melt. Oh, hey, it's you. <sighs> hey, you. Tell us where Master Cyrus went. To hell. Where are you after you disappear at the spear? Hell, I just told you. Huh? The distortion run? No. I mean, yes, but hell sounds better. And where Giratina was, you're not making any sense. Don't play that card with me. Fine. You don't want to talk? I'll bash you and make you talk. God dang it. Forgot there were battles here. <sighs> Still only got three Pokemon. It shouldn't be that difficult. See how much this does. Punchy punch attack. Kaboom. And... Not gonna lie, that's less than I would have liked. Waste well, his turn though, so that's okay. Can I get a fly, please? Watch it use reflect now or something and just completely screw me over. Now, that screws me over pretty good too, though. Frankly, um, let's let's switch to somebody a little better suited for this, I guess. Come on, mischief. Try out a Shadow Ball. Ah, it could hurt a little. Very annoying. Yeah, that did um, so much more damage than I would have liked. Can I get a knockout, please? Uh, no. No. Not even close. And that's probably just going to knock me out, right? Okay, it didn't. Oh, right, because the light screen was still up. God damn it. That was my own fault. That should do it then. Alright, cool. Very good. Alright, what do you have next? Go back. <sighs> Normally, I just fight Go back with Mischief, but I don't think I can. Let's try Pangea's Rock Slide, I guess. It's gonna go first, yeah. How frustrating. Don't hurt yourself, Pangea, I swear to God. All right, cool. And it hit. Very nice. You need to hit again, but I think I can pull it off. Ouch. Oh, come on. Stupid. Oh, come on. Pangea, you suck. Here, have a potion. 
Ugh, don't poison me. Screw you! Starting to really hate this thing. Can I please, can I please break through confusion again now? God damn it. Here, have another stinking potion. You gotta love when you get your ass handed to you by an NPC. Even a relatively important one, simply because of bad RNG. Like, like, I think a little bit of a little bit of RNG in a Pokemon game is fine, but I definitely understand some players who hate it, right? Ah, finally, good riddance. And Perugly next. Let's um go into Greyfeather for Punchy Punch Attack, I guess. What's it actually called? Close Combat. My last Close Combat. I gotta make it make it count. That hmm. That hurt more than I had hoped it would with Intimidate. But I knocked it out, so it doesn't matter. Bye. Hey, is the other one gonna fight me too? My Pokemon let me down. How am I supposed to get information about our missing Master Cyrus? Mars, you really are weak, pitifully so. You make me embarrassed to be a commander like you. Fine, I'll go up next. God damn it. I want to know what became of Master Cyrus too. God damn it. I don't even care. I don't even care about this fight. I've fought her so many times. I don't need... I, it, it just does not even matter to me at all. Alright, Sluggo, hit this thing with your new move, Earth Power. And let's try to end this quick. Get it. Very cool looking attack, by the way. Will that be enough? Certainly hope so. Eh, not quite. Now it's eating a stinking berry. But another one should do it, and I should survive whatever it throws at me next. Barely? Holy shit. But that does it. Fantastic. Alright, can we be done now? Can your, can your organization just be disbanded now? How dare you. Okay, uh, that's it uh, for me. I'm going to look for Master Cyrus. The Distortion World, was it called? I should go there, right? Yeah. Go to hell. Yeah, I don't even care. Following Mars's lead and anything irks me, but... I'm quitting to do, my, to do my own thing, too. Team Galactic's just no fun without Master Cyrus around. So, old-timer, go ahead. Do what you want with Team Galactic. There you have it. We're going to back to being ordinary girls. Now you can mop up uh, whichever way you want. All right. Is she talking to me? I'm going to do that. It says you, an ordinary girl, you're not. What, I, what should I do now? Is leaving on a journey the right idea? I don't care what you do. Just never talk to me again. <sighs> so impressionable and impetuous. And what do they see in Cyrus? Immature, overthinking buffoon. He goes to the trouble of assembling Team Galactic for what? Ultimately, he destroys his own creation with his ludicrous vision. Yeah, he did do that. And it's no thanks to him that I have to struggle with the pieces. That's fine. Now, the young can live with their dreams. I prefer to remain firmly in reality. And for that, money is paramount. Now, you there, child. I'm not dealing with you. Okay. After all, the other Galactic members who it did all suffered concert. That is true. The guy's smart. But we have to collect the Magna Stone. It's all for the money. Alright. I'm just gonna come after you, right? You know that, right? Alright, so this episode's been going on way too long already. I'm gonna have to cut it up to keep it at time or even anything close to it. So, unfortunately, uh, I was really hoping to do some training in between videos, uh, but unfortunately, god, my team is a wreck, too. I'm gonna have to end it here. Next time, we will head into the mountain, and I guess I'll just do some training with Buck in the mountain proper. Um, kind of in the midst of the next recording session, which is, which is fine. Doesn't really change anything, right? Um... We're just a little too far away from it at this point, I think. In the meantime, though, 
This has been AJ22, and I will talk to you guys later.